their opponent to just 42% shooting from the field. Well, that's because they get back in transition. Their offense is very balanced. Now 0 of 4 from the field after a blistering quarter in the first. Watch comes in out of that timeout. Blasting along the baseline, Elijah Bell that throws it right into the hands of Bowen. Here comes Tony Parker streaking down the lane, lays it in. Be done mainly because they're not deep on their bench. Their starters have to play a lot of minutes. Put it. Greg Popovich calling Oberto the ugliest pretty player I've ever seen. From the outside and for three, it's Robert Ory. Here come the Suns on the run, but back defensively, Tony Parker. We have to get them head on. Michael Finley rising up before Raja Bell. You know, when you walked into the Suns locker room, too, one of the notes on the board by Suns assistant coach Mark Ivor. 0 of 2 from the field, missing both free throws. They will have a run in this game, and they have done a great job of just maintaining their small lead up until now. Their lone run came. Figures, 10 points, has three assists so far. Remember, had the 19 assists. He is a, is a, he is a flop. I'm not gonna, <laughs> he is a flopper, but not to the extent of the goal. I mean, they're the improvisational skills of Steve Nash. Now defending Parker, and it drops for Tony. And the ball was up on the rim. That should be an offensive goaltending. The officials blew that one. Hey, Sun's biggest lead has been six. Close battle throughout. Ori behind the line. Going deep for three. Go and run down the court and play deep. A little exuberant right there, but, you know, here's a guy that will bury you. Ori one-handed carom. Hands it back to Tony Parker. Ori now with 10 rebounds, and there is time. They have gone 17 and 6. Parker dips in. Havrick's Greg Popovich just walks over and shakes the hand of Mike D'Antoni.